I'm Richard Brown and I do wood sculptures. I'm not a wood carver, but more of a sculptor. I've been doing it for 50 years. My uncle was a furniture repairer in Winona years ago and he, uh, he had to carve drawer pulls and stuff like that. And so he had all these carving tools and some of them are really rather expensive and old antiques. But I pretty much wore those out because they're better than new ones. Started out very much as a carver and doing realistic more figures, but especially in the last five years, I've been getting a little more creative, I think, and doing fantasy figures more than. Well, I use mostly wood, I mean, primarily, but I'll use anything that'll work. I don't have the whole thing planned out when I start. I start with a part and then just keep working. In fact, sometimes I've started sculptures where I don't even have a figure in it and then I put one in later. The funny thing is it keeps getting larger and I'm going to have to cut, cut sides down because I can't handle them anymore. Well, I just enjoy it more now because I have all the time I want to work on it. I'm very slow because of, obviously I'm old <laughs> and uh, Parkinson slows me down a little I think bit. Slow, slowing me down helps me develop because I have time to, things come to you anytime and the more time you have to have ideas come to you the better it is I guess. So, but in the last years it has been the best. I didn't plan on building this thing to work in because I thought it was done with carving. But uh, it's the only thing I really can do well that and I enjoy it. I can stay out here all winter, it's warm enough in here. Well, I plan on having one or two canopies on my driveway and back by my garage. And uh, then people will be able to come back here and look at this. And I'm glad for this opportunity to have this Bluff Country show. It's easier to do artwork if you don't have to sell it, if you're not keeping in mind, well, who would buy this? Just do what you want and let, and you don't have to sell it. Let them decide whether they want it or not. Do what you want. You're bound to do be more creative, I think. You're not thinking about, well, gee, no one would want that or something like that. You don't have to care. It took me a long time to learn that lesson. <laughs>